Hey everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing something uh, really special. We're going to be unboxing my brand new computer, um, the Dell XPS 15. And this thing is beautiful. It's basically like the, in terms of design, it's like the Windows version of a MacBook. It's pretty cool. Um, I'm just so excited. and. Um, as you can see, there's my old computer sitting on the chair. And um, in the description below, I'll uh, do a comparison like of the specs between uh, this one and my old one. So um, let's get started. I can't, I'm just so excited. Uh, uh, okay, so let me just cut this. I'm going to try and get the best angles I can. This is my first uh, unboxing video, so I'm sorry if I uh, can't get the best angles. Uh, uh, come on, cut that. This is gonna be kind of hard to do the way they put this. Uh, they literally taped right over the little tab thing that's here, so I guess I just have to cut that. Uh, Alright, uh, and then take that out. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna need uh, two hands for this, maybe. Um, hmm, how am I going to do, go about doing this? Uh, let me just put this on the side here and try to uh, get it out this way. Uh, hmm, actually, that's a good angle, right? Yeah, that's perfect. Uh, all right. Uh, oh, it's stuck on something. Let me try and fix that. All right. And slides out just like that. Perfect. Um, all right, let me get my camera. And let's see, this should slide off somehow. I can't tell if this is upside down or not. Um, it'll be awkward if it is. Um, all right, so let's see what we got here. Um, looks like a bunch of CDs, maybe. Yeah, um, drivers and utilities, so that seems important. Uh, here's the power brick, um, that goes with the power brick, um, and here's probably like a bunch of like instruction manuals and whatnot. Yeah, quick start guide and all that stuff, so let me just put that over there for now. And here is the beauty. Um, it's upside down, I knew it. Uh, let me turn it. Look at this thing. Oh god, um, probably shouldn't have done that with the camera. Look at that. <laughs> Uh, let me see if I can open it up, or is it covered by plastic? Uh, yeah. Oh, it's backwards too. Makes sense. Uh, alright. Uh, <laughs> let me try and, let me put this on top of here real quick. Um, actually you guys can't really see that. I'll try and do my best here. If it, my camera would just stay on here. Um, alright, so, uh, let me take that off. Oh god, that's that feels so cool. It's like a rubberized plastic on the bottom. That's so nice. Uh, and it's like a nice uh, aluminum finish on here too. So, uh, all right. Uh, let me get my camera. So here it is with the plastic off, and here's the bottom. I think it's actually not. It's very sturdy. I have to say, like it's not like a like plastic like that one over there. Um, Let's open this up, and it's a nice 1080p display. Um, take that off, and oh man, that's awesome. <laughs> Has a beautiful track Mac-like trackpad. Um, God, this is awesome. <laughs> and let's see. So let me try and turn it uh, this way. It's not exactly the best uh, way to display, but there you go. It's pretty thin. Um, let me close that, and. It's really nice, oh my god. <laughs> um, Alright, so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug it in. Where is the power brick? I'm going to plug this in and turn it on and go through all the startups and whatnot. And once I do that, I'll start recording again and I'll show it off some more. Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Um, so I've got the computer all set up now. and. Um, for, I was just playing Minecraft for a little bit and like testing it out to see what kind of FPS I could get. And um, let me show you. Um, 
right now I'm getting uh, I can't really see clearly but it was up to 281 right there um, which is pretty decent it's good better than the 10 I was getting on that so um, yeah it's I'm so happy about that and um, if you take a look here um, not really too high CPU usage. Um, the reason why it's um, at 32% right now is because Minecraft uses one core, so that Minecraft core is probably close to being maxed out and whatnot, so that's probably why it's that high. And um, I have 8 gigs of RAM, I'm using currently using a little over 4. So it's pretty good. Uh, better than uh, better than what I got on that. So um, let me just uh, minimize everything here. Um, so I didn't really transfer everything over onto whoops onto here yet. That's what I'm sort of doing here. Um, I'm working on just putting everything onto my flash drive, and then I'm going to take my flash drive and put it onto there. So um, that's that. Um, after that, I'm going to try and uh, do some benchmarks, maybe with uh, some of the games I have, and then um, uh, that'll be that. And then uh, I can make better videos, uh, better quality, and uh, less lag and all that stuff. So, um, uh, overall, I am very happy with uh, this computer. The only downside is that, um, I don't know if you can hear it or not, um, but the fans are kind of like, are uh, a little loud, but whatever, I can live with that. I kind of have to live with that. I don't have much of a choice. Um, but yeah, so that's that. Um, this computer served, uh, served me well for the past five years. It kind of had some abuse. Uh, as you can tell, there's a missing enter key right there, and uh, some of that's broken off. Uh, and now, uh, it's on to this baby. Uh, so, uh, thanks for watching, everybody, and uh, I'll see you next time.